out, I would do kind of um, some yarn reviews as well as show you some things that I've been working on, some things I've kind of have finished. Um, but let's start with the non-yarny things first. So I know y'all know what diamond painting is. So this is one I finished for my dad. Um, I made some for my mother-in-law, but she's already got those um, because th those ones are finished. I just finished this one for my dad, so I just need to get it framed. But I'm sure y'all can see what it is. But um, so did that one for my daddy, and then this one. I don't know how well I'm going to be able to show you this one because it's really big. Um, I don't know if you guys can see it. So you've got the trees and then you got the peacock. I've got most of all of this finished. Like all of this is done. I've only got like just this little bit left to do. Um, so that one is in a work, a pot, or yeah, in the works. This one's in the works. And then I got some others, but I haven't started them. Um, I do, I do have one, I, but it's put up right now. It's um, a lighthouse. Um, I do have two lighthouses. One is for my husband, and one is for um, his dad, because they both love lighthouses. Um, Y'all know about my one blanket. I ran out of the gray I needed, so other than that, it's almost done. Um, let me move this stuff out of the way real quick. I've got this blanket I'm working on. I don't know if you can see the pattern, but um, this one is just for my husband and I at home. It's got um, um, kind of the braided cable look going on, and then just the regular, um, oh, it's upside down. Anyhow. So it's kind of got like the regular granny, or not even granny, I don't know what you call it, like the double crochets right here. And then it's got the front post. I don't know if you can see that. But, so, I'm working on that. Um, I can't remember what yarn it is. I had actually ordered it online. But look at those colors. Aren't those pretty? Um... So, yeah, been working on that. That's been like a slow thing. Um, I did start um, a shawl. And then I kind of put it to the side because I had a baby all of a sudden come. Um, that I had to crochet some things for. And, um, and then a wedding. So this kind of got put on hold. But, um, I don't even remember where I got the pattern for that. But this is the Yarn Art, um, Angora Active. I got this from, um, Hobium. So, it is 100 grams, 500 meters, or 546.80 yards. So, I don't know if you can see that. Focus. There you go. So it's 25% mohair and 75% acrylic. And then the color is 852. But look at those colors. This reminds me of the beach. I absolutely love it. There's another view. <clears throat> so I got this in the pack. So I got, I think, five or six of these. Um, but super, super pretty. It's not super soft. Uh, I mean, it's soft, but it's not like super, super soft. And that's probably from the mohair. But, oh, I just love the color. It is so gorgeous. And then the other thing is um, the Kartofu. And I'm going to kill the name. Focus. No. There we go. Um, Madrioshka, Madrioshka Lux, I don't know. When you feel it this way, it is really soft, right? But 
when you work it, it's not so soft. It, it feels like this. Um, and this is 70, 72% acrylic, 14% wool, and 10% Lincoln. And then it's got the 4% 4, 4 metallic. Um, let's see. The color is S the uh, SOH2162 um, there's 875 yards 7.5 7 7.05 ounces so I love it it's got the purples like the deep purples and kind of the peaches this one I'm doing um, I don't know like a table I've got another one um, in the works but um, I'm making this for a table runner. But I did crystals. Uh, I don't know if you can see it. I did crystals. Uh, little granny square. Well, it's not so little, but um, I did use a bigger crochet hook than it called for because I wanted it loose and lacy, not um, super tight. Because it is going to go on a table, um, coffee table. So. Anyhow, that's kind of how the colors worked out. That's, that was really pretty. The other one, and this is what was cool, is the center is like this light lavender color. And this one, and then this one is the darker purple. So I thought that would be really neat. So the colors will change. So I mean, easy to work with. In fact, both of these, I mean, I know a lot of people don't like the really thin um, yarns. In fact, this is more of like... I'd say a one or even a sports weight like it's really thin this is just a little bit thicker so I'd say this is more the two um, I don't even know if it says yeah it doesn't even give a, a weight um, ne neither did this oh this one says a one so I agree this is like a, a, a one a fine one it says super fine, so yeah, I'd agree with that. But this one, I definitely, um, it's more of a two. It's closer to a two. But, um, and then the other thing I've been working on, and I don't know if I like this. I can't say if I like it or not. I'd love to know how to make this. But all the instructions are in, I don't know if you can see it, a language I don't understand. So, um, I've just been kind of knitting it. And this is kind of how it's turning out, and I don't like it. Um, so, I'm going to undo it. But... I don't know if anyone knows how to work with this kind of yarn. Let me know because I'm not liking it at all. Um, so I don't know. Don't have much to say about that. And then this one, um, I love this. This is so soft. Um, I was working with it. I was gonna knit um, my father-in-law a scarf out of this, but. It kept, I kept dropping stitches and yeah, so I don't know, I'll probably just crochet in one, but this is 200 grams, 540 meters or 590 yards. It is 20% wool, 80% acrylic. They say it's a three. I would definitely agree that it's a DK3 for sure because um, it's, it's pretty small. But this is actually for um, planned pulling, if I remember right. Yeah, planned pulling. I don't know if you can see that. I don't know if it's backwards or not, but focus. I don't know if it's going to focus or not. There we go. So, but this is the La Mia um, Echos, Ecos, I don't know, but... Um, the color is LE006. It's easy to work with. Um, I didn't. I haven't crocheted with it yet, but I did knit with it. Um, 
and it's easy it oh and it's so so soft so if you plan on going to hobium definitely look at this it is a little on the pricey side so i only got two of them um but it's not too expensive and it is really 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 soft so yeah that is what i've been doing um i got a surprise for y'all but i'm gonna wait um until um it gets bigger but i do have a surprise um to eventually show you hey pony says hi so yeah i think that was all i wanted to show you um while i've been working on this see if i can't pull it all out for y'all I know I showed you some other ones that I made, but I'm making another one. Now you can actually really see the, the color. But what I like about this is you can make it small or you can stretch it out and you can make it wide. I love it. Absolutely love it. And it is just, oh, I like it. So, I might have to buy me some to make me a scarf out of. Um, but yeah, so that's what's been on my work table. Um, I do have... Uh, let's see, hold on. I, there's one more yarn I wanted to show you. So, um, this was the other one I wanted to show you. I don't know if y'all remember me buying it. Now, I love it. I think it's really pretty, but it just, I don't know. It doesn't work up the same as, like, that last one I showed you. It's, um, really heavy. Like, really, really heavy. It, I don't know. So, if anyone can give me some ideas, um, because I've tried where I've skipped so I only worked here. See where there's just the two there. So I'd skip these and I'd only work in these ones right here. So I'd skip and then I'd work and then I'd skip and then I'd work. But oh it's it just was still really heavy. So if anyone's got any ideas, um And like a better way of crocheting it let me know because otherwise I just I don't know maybe do it in a giveaway and they can sew it on something I guess I have no idea but anyhow so yeah that was kind of what's been going on with me um, my allergies have been so horrible so I've not really felt very good lately so um, we did have really good weather for a couple of days but now it's back to being cloudy and ugh, just horrible weather up here. But um, I don't know. So I guess I think I'll let y'all go. And um, I know I was going to do a tutorial. Actually, there's one thing I know I, I've been meaning to do. And I really should just, I should just get off my lazy behind and do it. Um, why I've got everything out and about. But, um, okay, well, I will let you guys go. Don't forget that, yeah, um, I still have that, um, giveaway going on, um, and it ends July 31st, midnight Pacific time. Okay, um, so definitely let your friends and your family know. I did finally hit, I think it was, I don't know, I'm just over 200 and something, um, so really cool, um, anyhow, I will talk to you guys later, love you bunches, and have a great day or night, until then, bye-bye.